everyone i am priya from edureka welcome to this session today in this session we will be learning about large language model explained large language models have you ever wondered how machines understand and generate human like text llms such as gpt3 and bert are advanced ai systems trained on massive amount of text data they use a complex algorithms to analyze patterns in language allowing them to generate a coherent and contextually relevant data these models have revolutionized natural language processing powering applications like language translation sentimental analysis and text generation join us as we dive into the fascinating world of llms and also exploring their inner workings and practical applications today in this session we will learn about large language models how they work and their business applications moving forward we will understand the benefits of llms and then we will discuss the differences between llms and traditional models but before we get started with the topic please consider subscribing to our youtube channel and hit the bell icon to stay updated on latest tech content by edureka also visit the edureka website for training and certification courses the link to is in the description box below So first understand what is large language models Large language models are machine learning models that uses a deep learning algorithms to understand natural language They are trained on large amount of text data to learn patterns and entity relationships This can perform a various language task sentimental analysis and chatbot conversation and also including translations They can understand complex textual data identify entities and relationships and generate a coherent grammatical accurate new text large language models are predefined on vast amount of data using techniques like fine tuning in text learning and zero one few short learning now we will understand how these large language models will work large language models consist of three main components first one is data and then architecture and the third one is training These models are trained on enormous amount of text data enabling them to understand language patterns and notions. Large language models utilizes a neural network architectures particularly transforms which handles a sequence of data such as sentences or lines of code. The transformer architecture allows a model to understand the context of each word in the sentence by considering its relationship with every other word. During training The model learns to predict the next word in the sentence and adjust its parameters to reduce the difference between its predictions and actual outcomes. Through iterations, the model gradually improves its word predictions until it can reliably generate coherent sentences. After pre-training, the model can be fine-tuned on smaller, more specific datasets to refine its understanding and improve task performance. And finally, Fine tuning enables the model to become a proficient in specific task, transforming a general language model to an expert in a particular domain. Now, let me give you few examples of large language models. First one is GPT-3 from OpenAI. GPT-3 is a versatile for various applications, which means it has impressive capabilities, make it suitable for a wide range of applications. And then it excels its text generation tasks such as generating articles stories and poetry and then gpt3 is also utilized for language translation tasks enabling accurate and contextually relevant translations across multiple languages and also in addition to this it is employed for question answering systems where it can provide a detailed and informative responses to user queries and the next application is bird from google Bird's is a bidirectional training approach allows it to capture the context from both directions making it highly effective for various NLP tasks and it is widely used in a sentimental analysis application helping business analyzes customer feedback and engage public opinion Bird is also employed for named entity recognition task where it accurately identifies and classifies entities such as name of people organizations and locations in text data furthermore bird is utilized in machine translation systems 
facilitating accurate and fluent translations between different languages. Moving forward, the next application we have is T5 from Google. T5's unique text-to-text -text approach makes it versatile for handling a wide range of NLP tasks. It is commonly used for summarization tasks where it can generate a concise and informative summarizes of longer text. T5 is also applied in text classification tasks, helping classify documents, emails or social media posts into a relevant categories. Additionally, it is utilized for language generation tasks, enabling the creation of conversational agents and chatbots capable of engaging in natural and coherent dialogue with users. And the last example of large language models is Robert from Facebook AI Research. Robert does robust optimization and fine-tuning on large datasets make it highly effective for various NLP applications. It is commonly used in sentimental analysis tasks providing accurate assessments of sentimental from text data. Robata is also applied in text classification tasks, helping categorize text data into predefined classes or labels. Furthermore, it is utilized in natural language understanding tasks, enabling systems to cooperate and interpret human language input accurately. Now, let us understand the benefits of using large language models. First one is, reduce manual labor and cost. By automatically a number of tasks like sentimental analysis, customer support, content production, fraud detection, prediction and classification, LLMS cuts down the manual labor and associate expenses. And the second benefit is enhance availability, personalization and customer satisfaction. Large language models give companies the ability to use a chatbots and virtual assistants to offer 24 by 7 availability. By processing enormous volumes of data to comprehend customer behavior and preferences, automated content creation powered by LLMS enabling personalized services, boosting customer satisfaction and developing strong brand relationships. And the third benefit is save time. Large language model systems automate data entry, customer support and other marketing stuffs like sales and customer service processes. Because of this, employees can concentrate on duties requiring human expertise. Moving forward, we have improved task accuracy. Because of large language models are adept at handling a large volume of data, they produce a better result when it comes to a task like classifications and predictions. Learning patterns and correlations from data helps large language models to create more accurate classifications and forecasts. For example, in sentimental analysis, large language models can examine a large number of customer reviews to ascertain the sentimental underlying each one precisely. This is important for companies that place a high value on accuracy. Moving forward, we have facilitate innovations and creativity. These models are effective instruments for encouraging innovations and creativity by encouraging the investigations of novel ideas concepts and solutions. Through their text generations capabilities, these models can help with the creativity, creative writing and brainstorming sessions. They can also help writers, artists and researchers to create original content and investigate non-traditional methods of problem solving. And the last benefit of these models is improved decision making and risk management. By offering insightful analysis and predictions based on sizable datasets. These models contribute to the enhancement of decision-making procedures and risk management. This can help with the business identity opportunities, reduce risk and make a well-informed decisions by examining past data and finding trends. This skill is especially helpful in industries like supply chain management, healthcare and finance. Now, let us discuss the differences between large language models development versus traditional development. Large language models development requires a vast amount of text data for pre-training, whereas traditional development may require smaller datasets. Large language models are complex neural network with a millions to billions of parameters, while traditional models are simpler with a fewer parameters. Next, these models are pre-trained on large text corpora followed by fine-tuning whereas traditional models are trained directly on task-specific data. 
Moving forward, we have a difference as large language models are less interpretable due to their complex architecture, whereas traditional models are generally more interpretable. And the next difference is large language model development demands significant computational resources and large scale text datasets, while traditional development may require a less computational power and data. And the last difference large language models are mainly used for natural language processing tasks whereas traditional models have broader applications across various domains. With this, we have come to the end of this session. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to like and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thanks for watching and keep learning. I hope you have enjoyed listening to this video. Please be kind enough to like it and you can comment any of your doubts and queries and we will reply them at the earliest. Do look out for more videos in our playlist and subscribe to Edureka channel to learn more. Happy learning!